every garden needs herbs. Herbs like this rosemary are what transform meals, contributing bags of flavour and turning the ordinary into the extraordinary. The great thing about herb gardens is that they can be designed for any style, size or shape. If you're looking for a few ideas to fit more herbs into your garden, you've come to the right place. There are herbs for every situation, so whether you have just a compact corner to spare or an entire garden, you can use herbs to create a space that's both useful and beautiful. Choose herbs suited to your growing conditions. Herbs like rosemary, oregano, sage and thyme thrive in drier, sunnier positions, while softer, leafier herbs like mint, parsley, chives and lovage grow well in moist, part-shaded areas. Grow herbs in among your vegetables, alongside flowering ornamentals, in a wildflower meadow, on the patio, or within a dedicated herb garden. The choice is yours. When designing with herbs, the first thing to consider after growing requirements is growth habit. Tall, statuesque herbs like angelica contribute vertical interest to the garden. They are generally planted towards the back of a bed, so they don't overshadow shorter plants, but can also look great thrusting skywards amongst lower growing plants. Medium sized herbs, from about 1 to 3 foot, or 30 centimetres to a metre in height, will form the bulk of your planting. Combine a variety of leaf shapes, colours and textures to break up blocks of planting. And of course, most herbs will also draw in numerous beneficial bugs, most noticeably bees that will go on to help pollinate vegetables and fruits. Lower growing herbs like parsley or chives should be planted at the front of any scheme, where they can form a neat edging or spill outwards. Herbs for edging look simply stunning. Grown alongside a path, they'll release their aroma every time you brush past. Creeping herbs like thyme, oregano and prostrate forms of rosemary are great for growing within paving. Planted into cracks, opportunistically at the edges, between slabs or in other gaps. From here they'll extend out to soften hard surfaces, while taking advantage of the radiated heat to waft their delicious fragrance even further. These types of herbs work well, bursting out from any landscape surface to create a more relaxed informal feel or try planting them en masse to form a practical yet highly attractive living mulch that also works to crowd out weeds. Formal herb gardens use straight lines and patterns for pleasing symmetry. Raised beds especially lend themselves to this type of setup, helping create a sense of ordered calm. Plant a mix of herbs or just one type of herb per bed to emphasise the order and make maintenance far simpler. Formal needn't be on a grand scale. A simple herb wheel is a great way to pack a handy selection of herbs into a space little wider than your average steering wheel. Selecting herbs that enjoy the same growing conditions, like this wheel of Mediterranean herbs, makes ongoing care easier. While dividing up the space into individual planting pockets helps stop herbs growing into each other or one herb from dominating. Many gardeners can only afford space for a few pots of herbs, but that doesn't mean you can't design an effortlessly stylish herbal heaven. Cluster pots of herbs, salads and vegetables together to create a living tapestry of leafy loveliness. Use bold forms like rosemary to create a feature on your terrace, or mix them up in stone or metal troughs and herb towers to really pack your herbs in, while ensuring an eye-catching centrepiece that feeds both body and soul. Herbs can also be used to offer vertical interest by growing them in containers held up on posts or secured onto walls and fences. Designing your own herb garden is hugely satisfying and our garden planner makes it easy. Play around with different layouts at your leisure. Drop in any number of containers, planters, troughs or raised beds from the selection bar or design your own beds using the drawing tools here. Once you're done, select herbs from the drop-down menu and begin planting. If you're unsure which herbs are best for your garden, click on the information buttons here for handy growing advice plus details on how each herb may be used. You can also use the custom filter button here to narrow down the selection to show for example only easy to grow plants or plants that will grow in partial shade. Have fun trying out a few designs and perfecting a herb garden that's unique to you. 
Herbs contribute so much to the garden and us, whether it's a little something for livening up recipes or a profound sense of beauty. I hope we've given you some inspiration to get started anyhow. If you already have a herb garden, please do tell us about it in the comments section below. Is it formal or informal? Separate from the rest of the garden or interspersed throughout? We'd love to know. And we'd love you to become a regular visitor to this channel as well. So make sure you're subscribed. I'll catch you next time.